from LA Late News headquarters in Santa Monica. This is Mornings, LA Late. It's a big morning with huge news about this economy as more housing data is being released today. While the housing data show you, we'll go over the latest details as we battled inflationary pressures last week. The CPI surging higher dramatically than expected. We'll have the latest details on what's going on and also why it's great news for your benefits. Your benefits are going up a lot, approximately $5,000. This is you if you're on SSI, SSDI, rural benefits, veterans benefits, and more. We'll go over the latest details across the board. But what's really at issue today is the raise of your bet is also the inflationary pressure. And that inflationary pressure is manifested in the new housing data. We'll go over the new housing data being released today, what it means for this economy and what it means for you. That numbers started yesterday. And we'll go over more about those numbers today across the board. That is why you have to become a member right today. Go right on this video and become a member for the Hawk or a Power Calcino VIP and get these incredible four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. And you know what? You qualify. Single individual, seventy-five thousand less. Go get it. Married couple, one hundred fifty thousand less. Go get it. And if you're on benefits, go get it as well. We got a big broadcast today. We're going to go over approximately five thousand dollars more that your benefits are going up. The one hundred thousand dollars of four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. You get them today. You go get them. I'm going to show you how to get them later this morning. And a big shocker of a story. Oh boy, it's a shocker. The Bill Back Better Act could be split into two bills. Two bills. I'll have the latest details on the first bill and the second bill, and also preview brand new LA two and three coming to this channel. That's why you have to become a member. Go right on this video and get those incredible checks. Stay the second half as we go over each of these incredible checks one at a time. It's a big, bold, beautiful broadcast, and you deserve lots of money. We got it for you in this recording. One hundred thousand dollars of checks. $5,000 for raising your benefits, and fifteen dollars to $80,000 of approximate money in the Build Back Better Act. The toast is toasting, the butter is buttering, the heat is toasting as well. <laughs> and a big, bold, beautiful morning's LA heats up its feet, starting right here, right now, on a gorgeous July morning, starting right now. Good morning, everybody. I hope you're having a beautiful day. It is gorgeous along the coast, but it's going to be hot again today. I hope you're cool where you are. Become a member. Go right in this video. Join this channel because you deserve this incredible money. We're going to go over all this incredible money later in this recording. It's a lot. It's a huge whopping $100,000 across the United States done by executive action from Joseph Biden back in the month of March. We'll go over those incredible checks later in this recording. And you deserve this money. You deserve Deserve it, and also the incredible news about your benefits going up approximately five thousand dollars. This is you if you're on SSI and SSDI railroad benefits and more. We'll be looking at the dates at issue that's coming up later in this recording. But we start first with the breaking news stories that impact your money, your wallet. They are the CPI, the PPI, the retail sales, and the latest numbers coming in today on the housing front. What's going on? Well, as a new week is upon us, we're looking at the data that comes in from Wall Street, and that data is really telling. That data gives us indication about how deeply entrenched we are in a recession and how deeply that inflation has not settled down across the board. Let's go over all the numbers starting right now. A new week is upon us, and those inflationary numbers last week shocked our feet off. Well, guess what? This week it continues. Minutes ago, new numbers came in on the recessionary front. We're looking at two things, recession and inflation. First on the recessionary front, we're looking to see if the corporate earnings are suffering the pressure of recession. And they have. Here we go. IBM was down, it posted a beat today in its second quarter earnings. NCR reported a major beat. Its stock is up 12%. Halliburton is up 2% after its beat. 
Cinemark had a beat as well, and Hasbro, the toy manager, had a beat as well. Fascinating, because this is what we teach on this channel. This is what we watch in this economy. Different parts of the economy will go into the recession at different times. Some will suffer the recessionary pressures more than others, and this is what's been manifest in those second quarter corporate earnings starting last week. These corporate earnings are not banks, but last week we had two banks that reported second quarter down 50% in one quarter. Ouch. That is that recessionary pressure. Why is it important for you to know this? Because it impacts your wallet. First way it's going to impact you is layoffs. We're going to see those new jobless claims released this Thursday. 244,000 last week in new jobless claims. It could surge to 250. And that layoffs comes as the news as these corporations are reporting less earnings. As they report less earnings, then they have to save on the cost level. And how do they save on the cost level? They lay people off. We have surged dramatically on those unemployment numbers in recent weeks, from 200,000 to 240 in just a few days. This is because of the recessionary pressures. Those recessionary pressures pick up, and they manifest themselves in the higher unemployment numbers. Now, as we look at those retail sales numbers, those earnings, and those corporations reporting their numbers, what are we learning? We're learning that the corporate downturn or the corporate recession is impacting you. Those numbers for unemployment have surged from 188 to 244,000 new jobless claims per week in just a short period of time. This is important because it impacts your wallet. The other thing that impacts your wallet is inflation. What are we looking at on the inflationary front today? On the inflationary front, we have more housing data. Yesterday, we had the home builders data released by Wells Fargo, and it showed the largest second, the second largest drop of confidence among home builders since the start of the pandemic. That is the record number. This was the second largest drop in the 37-year history of the tracking. Why? Because the economy is slowing dramatically. That is the first of three housing data being released Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I'll have the Tuesday number later on Evenings LA. It has not yet been released. It's the new home starts number. Let's jump over to inflation. Inflation gives us a major read over a series of numbers, and they started last Wednesday with the Consumer Price Index, continuing on Thursday with the PPI, and continuing Thursday with the retail sales. Why is this important for you? Because it gives you an indication of how much your benefits are going up. The inflationary data started last Wednesday when the CPI read jumped dramatically from the month of May, 8.6%, to a whopping 9.1% in the month of June. This is a shocker, but it's great news for your benefits because your benefits will go built going up an astronomical amount. How does this work? Let's go over every detail of it in just a second. But first, let's start with what happened on that CPI on Wednesday. On Wednesday, the CPI, the Consumer Price Index, gauges how much consumers are paying for goods, continue to go higher. Inflation has not come down. We are looking at an 8.8% number. It came in at 9.1, higher than the month of May at 8.6%. And when you exclude food and energy, it continued to track higher. Then on, when, on Thursday, the producer price index number was released. This is also for inflation. It also went up higher as well. Rised 1.1% in the month of June, higher than expected. The PPI gauges how much wholesalers are paying for products. And then Thursday, the retail sales number was released, and this rose 1% for the month of June, higher than expected. Again, showing that inflation has not settled down. Now, this is really good news for you if you're on benefits. Why? Because your benefits are going to go up a lot. Congratulations. This is the benefit lift that you've always wanted, and it's happening. Let's go over how this benefit lift works starting right now. The benefits are going up a lot. And this is you, about $5,000 approximately. If you're on any type of benefits, SSI, Social Security, railroad benefits, veterans benefits, SSI, SSDI, BA, and more. And it's astronomically incredible. This is everything you have hoped for. And it's dependent upon three months, July, August, and September. We're going to be looking at that data in the next three months. This raise of your benefits is incredible, and let me go over what's going on. This raise of your benefits is the is being caused by inflation. 
And that cause of inflation is raising up all those incredible benefits across the board. Where does this kick in? How does this work? What do we need to know? Let's go over everything that's at issue starting right now. Your benefits are tied to a benchmark called COLA. And that COLA is tied to a benchmark called the CPI-W. Yes, it's a subsection of the CPI, which we just went over. And that CPI is inflation. Inflation for the month of June went higher. You just saw the number 9.1%. Higher than the month of May. You just saw that number as well, 8.6%. So if the inflation in this economy stays where it is or goes higher, in the current month, the next month, and the month thereafter, you're going to lock in the biggest raise of your benefits of your lifetime. We're going to experience this as a wonderful family together on this channel. Here's what's going on. We're going to watch the July, the August, and the September CPI numbers. They're released a month after it comes out. And those numbers, if they stay where June was or higher, you're going to have an incredible lift of your benefits. Let's go over how this works. We'll be automatic. What if you said yes? Same percentage for everyone else? Yes. You all have the same percentage. Bob Bacon asked Social Security? Yes. Includes Social Security. Includes all the benefits. $5,000? It depends on how much your current benefits are. It's absolutely wonderful. It's everything you've talked about. It's everything we've hoped for. It's everything we've covered for two years on this channel. SS300, SS200, everything we've always talked about. It's happening. That's why when you watch this recordings on this channel, that's why you watch the videos on this channel, you got to be tracking two things. One, recession, and two, inflation. In less than 14 days, this channel will expand from one channel to three channels. As you're watching LA1 right now, it's going to add on LA2 and LA3. On LA3, we'll be going over exactly this inflation and recession because it's so important to know how much your benefits are going up. If you want to know how much your benefits are going to go up, you're going to watch LA3. We're going to go over inflation and recession in detail on that channel. Meantime, if you want to know what's going on with the negotiations of the Build Back Better Act, that's going to LA2. Because guess what? Later this recording, I'm going to go over the bill may get split into two bills. <laughs> oh, wow. we got a big broadcast. Aren't you glad you tuned in live this morning? Well, a lot of other things are going on right now. And those other things that are going on right now is a shocker of a deal. Yes, there's a deal. A deal is in the work not for the Build Back Better Act, but for gasoline. The EU has sent its head overseas to Azerbaijan to buy natural gas because of the concern that Vladimir Putin is not going to turn back on Nord Stream 1. I hope the White House is watching this video because that's exactly what he should be doing as well. It's back on around July 12th that I recorded that there was a big concern. The concern was Nord Stream 1. Back on July 12th, I reported to you that Nord Stream 1, which is a pipe that feeds natural gas from Russia to Western Europe, is offline, turned off for routine maintenance. But at the time, I reported to you that Germany, France, and a lot of analysts said they don't believe that Russia is going to turn it back on to starve Western Europe of all of its natural gas. Well, guess what happened? <laughs> that was July 12th. Guess what happened yesterday? Yesterday, the EU's head went to sign a deal with Azerbaijan to get that natural gas. And that incredible deal is going to be solidified on the feature more tonight on Eden's LA. That deal for that natural gas is exactly what the White House should be doing because guess what? Your gasoline here in the United States is still missing. And also the Western Allies. Now, this is natural gas, what she's doing. But the petroleum, the real gas, is still missing. 3.5 million barrels of gasoline per day. If you remember this channel and you're watching the newsletter, especially last night, did you notice what happened? Did you notice what happened? The international price of gasoline went up a lot since last weekend. And yet the U.S. domestic unleaded at the pump went down a lot. What's going on, L.A.? International Brent crude surged to 107. It's heading right back to 120, the highest we've seen on this channel. It was 98 just a few days ago, the lowest we've seen since Putin invaded Ukraine. On the other side, we see the, fl the opposite happening. AAA national average at the pound of at the pump, it's dropped dramatically. It's now 440, 450. It's only about 20 cents above what it was when Putin invaded Ukraine. What's going on? 
the oil traders are trading up and down petroleum gasoline based upon the belief that maybe you won't be buying it if we go into recession. Fascinating across the board. Really fascinating. Ultimately, what you need to know is that this economy is stalling up. It's shrinking dramatically. And you need to get these four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. How do you get these four stimulus checks in every U.S. state? You do it right now. It's approximately $100,000, and you deserve these incredible sums of money. Pass them up the march by executive action from Joseph Biden. It's in every U.S. state. It's federal stimulus, and you qualify. Single individual, $75,000 less, go get it. Married couple, $150,000 less, go get it. If you rent, if you own, if you're on benefits, if you're not on benefits, go get it. Go get these incredible sums of money by becoming a member. Go right on this video and join this channel. Become a member and get that incredible membership signed up today to get those huge checks. Later in this recording, we're going to go over all these incredible checks one at a time. You deserve this money. Go on in this video and join this channel. It's a lot of money. How much is it? It's about $100,000. You deserve this money and you need to get this money. Because why? This economy is going to be much worse in less than 90 days. We're going through a series of phases. And those phases are the following. Stage one right now from November to September, then September to January is the financial cliff, and then January thereafter is the recession. A new report released yesterday featured on this channel had Americans saying that they believe we're already in a recession. Well, we believing that the recession is coming next year, actually, they said. That's actually not true. The recession has already started, but the heart of the recession will be felt next year especially. That's why you can't wait. If you look at what they're saying, the consumer, that they believe the recession is next year when it's already underway, then you certainly believe that, they'll, that the stimulus stampede will happen next year. When Americans really start to feel the hurt, they'll start coming looking for stimulus. That same report released yesterday had the people polled saying, now the cost of living has increased more than their actual paycheck. Well, one of the other benefits of becoming a member is those incredible L.A. worksheets, and viewers have absolutely loved it. It's another one of those incredible benefits you only get on L.A., created by L.A. for you. The membership worksheets are in the membership newsletter each night. At the third line of the newsletter, approximately, is a link that says here are the membership, news, uh, the membership worksheets. It's a PDF. If you have a printer signed up to your to your phone, you can print them off. If you don't, you can open them on your phone and then take notes, a separate piece of paper. What do we learn about the first page today, inflation? We learned that the housing data yesterday signal inflation is still going up, but we're watching today's data, which will be on evenings, and then tomorrow's data as well. We also learned that inflation tracked dramatically higher last month, and we're watching to see how much more it goes up because it impacts our benefits. Recession. We had the corporate earnings today. You know, everyone from Hasbro to also IBM actually showing not that much earnings recession on the corporate front compared to the banks yesterday. Yes, recession starts some places before it starts other places. Labor. We're going to see the Department of Labor's numbers on Thursday. 244,000 jobless claims new last week. I'm predicting it to go higher. When it gets to 250, it's going to freak out the markets. It has not yet freaked it out at 244. And then the Federal Reserve. Nothing new about the Federal Reserve today. I'm trying to have viewers not really focus too much on the Federal Reserve. Why? They're going to do 75 or 100 basis points. Who cares? It doesn't make really any much of a difference on your wallet. The second page of the Allied Worksheets is perhaps the most beloved. It's a table for you to keep track on all your stimulus. You're getting a lot of stimulus. You're going to get lots of stimulus. And you're going to get more stimulus thereafter. You've got to keep track on what months you got paid, who paid it for you. For example, let's say you got the water bill for March, April, and May from organization number one. It doesn't prevent you from going to organization number two and getting July, August, September. You need to keep track of who paid, when they paid, and also the contacts. It's incredible work, Shay, because guess what? There's a lot of different checks for you to get, and I'm going over them later in this recording. The next page is the stimulus. That is your benefits raise. Yes, we already went over that. That $5,000 approximately. But here's the great news. We're going to be tracking that inflation over the next three months, especially on LA3. And then the next page is the gas. We went over that NAC gas deal by the EU head of Azerbaijan. 
if only the White House got the petroleum gas deal done as well. And then finally, the last page is that student loan debt forgiveness. $10,000 being done by the President of the United States in a few days. He hasn't officially announced it yet for individuals who make one fifty dollars or less. In the second half of this video, we got a lot to go over. We're going to go over those incredible checks, those four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. I'll show you how to get them. You deserve them. You want to get them. Biggest payout we've ever had on this channel. We may or never have another payout this big. It's $100,000 you qualify. Then, a shocker of a news story, the Build Back Better Act potentially being split into two bills. I'll have a preview of the big story coming up tonight on afternoons at 3 and evenings at 3. For now, become a member. Go right on this video and become a member. Get the incredible membership newsletter Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, to get those incredible checks in every U.S. state. Stay the second half as we go over these incredible checks. $100,000. You qualify. Do not wait to get these incredible checks. They are federal stimulus done by the President of the United States. It's not state stimulus done in March. Viewers have been getting it since March. If you just found this channel, welcome. Become a member, but get these checks right now because you qualify. I'll be back with you in 60 seconds with the afternoons, with the second half of this morning's broadcast. And we'll be going over all these incredible checks at issue one at a time and show you how to get this wonderful sums of money. See you back in 60 seconds as Mornings I Like continues. If you want money right now, not five days from now, and not five weeks from now, then reach out to the community page. The volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities. That's at news.la.com forward slash community. The community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you. They can help you find rent, utilities, SNAP, food benefits, mortgage assistance, and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well. Their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from, and they'll get back to you shortly. That's a community page. Volunteers working for you, viewers helping one another. Stay with LA for more. Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. Home LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA Late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA Late. And the excitement continues in a beautiful day here along the coast for July 2022. Hope you're having a beautiful day. I know it's hot in some parts of the country, so I hope you stay cool. It's going to heat up here in Southern California as well. In this big second half, we're going to go over all these incredible four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. Have you become a member? Make sure you do. Go right on this video and join this channel. Click the button that says join this channel, become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power Cow, so you know, VIP. And let's go over all those incredible checks starting right now. Back in the month of March, viewers said to me, Ally, can you find me some checks? They haven't gotten that Build Back Better Act done. And I did. I found these checks, in fact, the day they were announced from the President of the United States by executive action. A series of checks. And they're big. Three things happened. One, I want to make sure they're big checks. They are. About $100,000. Number two, I want to make sure you qualify. I care about you. I want to make sure you qualify for the money. And you do. Single individual, $75,000 less. Go get it. Marry a couple, $150,000 less. Go get it. If you rent, if you own, if you have children, if you don't have children, and if you're on benefits, SSI, SSDI, VA, RB, go get it as well. Number three, I put it all together in a wonderful newsletter. As Carol said, you make it so easy, Ally. Right? Just put it all together for us to get it. And that is what we're going to go through right now. A series of checks, which I give a littering system to, starting with check A and continuing thereafter. The first check, you're ready? Here we go. Let's go into that very first check right now. It's a $6,500 to $12,000 for stimulus check in every U.S. state. Single individual, $75,000 less, go get it. Married couple, $150,000 less, go get it. And if you're on benefits, SSI, SSDI, Social Security, we're all benefits, go get it as well. How to get this wonderful check, you go under this video and join the channel. Become a member, Purple Hawk, Purple Power Cow, so you know VIP. Then go down the newsletter when you get it. Do you find check A? 
click the link, it sends you into the nationwide website, choose a state, and pounce. Get this incredible check A. You're not gonna done, be done there yet. You're gonna go get check B. Look at this money, fifteen dollars to $80,000. Wow, it's a forced stimulus check in every U.S. state. Single individual, $75,000 or less, go get it. Married couple, $150,000 less, go get it. If you're on benefits like SSI, VA, RB, go get it as well. How do you do it? You know the routine. <laughs> Become a member. Become a member, go right down in that membership newsletter that you will receive, and you find check B. Click the link, it sends you into the nationwide website. Choose your state and then choose the and then pounce and get that incredible sums of money. My goodness, did you see what just happened? <laughs> we just got a hundred thousand dollars right there. We got twelve thousand dollars for check A, we got eighty thousand for check B. There you go, one hundred thousand, baby. But we're not done there yet. We need to go get check C. Check C is deliciousness, it is for rent, utilities, mortgages. This is more and it's averaging two thousand dollars a month over 12 months. But many viewers have averaged at 45,000 and a lot have gotten over 150,000. Check C has been on this channel for a while because it's the residue of third stimulus. One of the success stories, these are some of the success stories, not all of them, it's just a sampling. We have had Nisi all the way up to Elizabeth, $27,000 for rent. You want that money for rent? Go get check C. Do you want $5,000 to $7,000 for utilities? Then go get check C. Mark's brother-in-law got $15,000. The same individual got is getting a quarter million dollars from this channel over 10 years for SNAP. And then look at these combinations. Nisi, Mark, Lorraine, Johnny. Nisi went from $23,000 to $50,000. Mark went from $32,000 to $166,000. He first went to a fifty, dollars then he went to one hundred, dollars and then he went to one sixty-six dollars because he got Chuck B. And here's Lorraine. She went from one hundred five dollars to $150,000. What is the commonality among those viewers? Lorraine, Johnny, Margaret, Mark, and similar ones couple of things. One, they watch all the videos. They're in all the live chats. You can see them because you need to know where this economy is and where it's going. If something pivots in the recessionary news, then that tells you, I got to get more stimulus. If something pivots in the inflationary front, then that tells you got to pivot. And if the new stimulus or something breaks, you need to know that on the moment. That's why they watch all the videos. Number two, they keep on getting checks. They keep on calling routinely to get additional checks. You get one check, you get another check. Johnny had gotten three checks in three days, 45000 He kept on calling. He made at least 15 calls in seven days, $80,000. Then he helped all his friends and neighbors, a lot of them. It was about two dozen people, $300,000 plus dollars that they got. So here's a recap. Number one, go under this video and subscribe. You're watching L8-1. Meantime, don't forget to subscribe to LA2 and LA3, the two new channels coming to this family. LA2 will feature stimulus and humor. LA3 will feature the economy and food. So you need to know where this economy is, and you need to go know what's going on with the Bill Bat Better Act and its negotiations. Number two, go under the video, go under this uh, the top of this channel, and hit the bell and make sure your notifications set to all on. Number three, go under this video and hit that join the channel button. Join the channel, become a member, Purple Hawk, Purple Power Casino VIP, and get these incredible checks. Now, here's a couple of things that you also want to go over with me. The newsletter. You ready? Let's do it. That LA newsletter delivered Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time via the YouTube alerts. It is incredible. It's so simple. The YouTube alerts delivers it. I write the alert. It's sent to you. Here is the alert. You go down the alert until you find the button that says View Posts. Click that button, View Posts. It's after the guy on the surfboard, and you are at the newsletter and done ready to rock and roll so simple and there is the wonderful newsletter just so simple monday through friday across the board want to see that again that's the newsletter let's do it again first it's delivered monday through friday 7 p.m pacific standard time so know your time zone if you're not on the West Coast, it's 10 o'clock Eastern, 9 o'clock Central, for example. The YouTube alerts. The YouTube alerts, many of you are sent by email. Here's the title from members only. There's the first line. It says membership newsletter today. Go down in that alert. Go down on the alert past the surfer and his surfboard. Go lower 
And to the very bottom, it says click and view posts. Click and view posts and goes right into the newsletter and you are done. So simple. You're on your way to that incredible sums of money. Become a member today. Get this incredible sums of money. Get that $100,000. Why? Because the financial cliff is upon us. That's the newsletter right there. You can't ro roll the dice. What I teach on this channel is get the money when it's available. Then we'll get more money thereafter. That's how we do it. Money today, money thereafter. Don't pass up any money when it's available. Grab it when it's there. Meantime, we have a series of surprising news stories coming out today about the Build Back Better Act. Let me go over what's going on on that front starting right now. The Build Back Better Act is back on, baby. I told you that several weeks ago. But today we have an interesting twist. I'll have it more on afternoons and evenings. The twist is really exciting. Let me take it back a step. Over the last few weeks, I said the negotiations have been underway between two people. Joe Manchin, the senator from West Virginia, and Chuck Schumer, the majority leader out of New York. I said the negotiations are going well. Apparently, they went really well. About a week ago, I told you that the two did a deal for prescription medication. A big achievement. Took many months in the coming. And so that is done. Well, the first breaking news story today out of that one is that Chuck and Joe have sent what they finish on prescription medication over to the Senate parliamentarian to have her say, yeah, you can include in the reconciliation. Go vote on it. That's the first step before you vote. They both agreed, Joe and Chuck, to send this over to the Senate parliamentarian. Who is she? She's a nonpartisan government official. She looks at language and says, does it belong in a, in a reconciliation or not? She's going to look at the prescription medication because Joe and Chuck sent it over to say, we're done. We're ready to rock and roll. We want to call the vote, see if we can include this language. Is the language going to pass? Ultimately, I'm not a parliamentarian. <laughs> it's my, my determination. She's the one who determines, not the Democrats and not the Republicans. But here's the reaction. On the Democrat front, they say it's going to get done by her. I'm not expecting a huge number of question marks that we're going to have to work through, says Tim, Senator Tim Kaine of Virginia. He's a Democrat. We have an we had this idea on the table for more than a year. The parliamentarian has been in discussions for a very long time. He is correct. I mean, she has been looking at it, but she's not looking at prescription medication before. So this is sort of new. On the Republican front, they're saying that she's not going to do that. You know, it's just it's people spinning uh, on both sides the equation. Senator Lindsey Graham says, we're going to be aggressive and try to stop it. Uh, no, she doesn't listen to either side. She's a nonpartisan government official. She's not going to listen to Tim, Tim Kaine, and she's not going to listen to Lindsey Graham. She's going to do what the law is. She's going to look and see whether the prescription medication belongs in there or not, and then she'll say yes or no, and then she'll say if it's yes, you can go vote. Now, okay, that's the first breaking news story. Second breaking news story is the talk of splitting this into two bills. This is really exciting. Let me explain first the procedural part about it, then I'll go over the substantive part about it. But the procedural part of it started with Joe Manchin on Thursday. He said on the record to news reporters, and also doing a, a meeting with Chuck Schumer, that, hey, you know, you and I have been negotiating this for a few months. We got a major agreement on the prescription medication. We're done. We send off to the parliamentarian. We think we're going to get approval for her. Call the vote. Now, the reaction from Schumer is not particularly clear at the moment, but other Democrats are not happy. Why? Because Joe Manchin's statement is the following. I've agreed upon this pot of items with Chuck Schumer. They're ready to be called a vote on, call the vote. That recon can pass right away now in July. We're done with those items. If those, since those items are done, Chuck and I have agreed upon them. Just call the vote and we're ready to rock and roll. And then the other items we haven't agreed upon, call the vote on those items in September when they're done. Let me go over procedurally what he's saying and whether it makes sense or doesn't make sense. Procedurally, it makes perfect sense. It makes absolute great sense. Why? I featured this a lot last year. Chuck Schumer saved up a lot of reconciliations. Normally, you're not only allowed a certain one reconciliation per Senate term, but if you save up a previous one or you do something, which he did, you can have more than one reconciliation. 
So you absolutely can have one reconciliation in July and then another one in September. So what Joe Manchin procedurally is saying is absolutely correct. You can do a recon vote today in July and that's done. And then the other things that have not been formally negotiated out and, de and done to an agreement, uh, uh, a negotiated settlement agreement, you can do those in September. You can actually have two reconciliations. What is the reaction? Let me, now that you understand the, the procedure, let me tell you the reaction. Democrats are, some Democrats are not happy with the reaction because of what Joe Manchin is leaving for September. What is he leaving for September? He is leaving the climate. Here's the Joe Manchin quote. If you're on a political deadline and it has to be done in July, then the one thing you could do has been done basically reducing prescription medication, letting Medicare negotiate, and that saves us about $280 billion a year over 10 years. Take $40 billion out of that and extend Obamacare and the discounts that the people are getting. We're done. He's absolutely right. Procedurally, he is 100% correct, and there's nothing wrong with what he's saying. He's actually very, very, very sensible. But here is what the reaction to the statement has manifested itself as. Here's examples. Senator Tim, Tina Smith, Democrat of Minnesota, says it's infuriating what Joe Manchin has done. The world is literally burning up while he joins every Republican to stop climate change. She's referring to, when she says burning up, she does not refer to your stimulus. She's referring to actually the climate outside. That's too hot. Then Jared Huffman, Democrat of California, says, it's important that every young person, every activist, the majority of this country are demanding climate ac action. Understand that this is not the Democrats. It's one man, Joe Manchin. And they're actually calling for him to be removed from ahead of the Energy Commission. So now let me explain to you what substantively is going on here. Substantively what's going on is Joe Manchin doesn't like climate provisions of the Bill Bath Better Act. You already know that because I've been featuring this on this channel for a long time. So what is he saying? We can negotiate out those climate provisions, which I've not still agreed to, in September, and then call a vote on Bill Bath Better Act number two in September. My opinion of the situation? My opinion of the situation is... There's nothing that prevents you from having five recons. So if you can do one recon and get it done in July, then do another recon in September, why not do it? Why just wait to have everything as a monstrosity, as one that is held up by a one provision? Do individual recons one at a time. Keep on doing them. I see there's nothing wrong with it. So I think he makes sense in what he's saying. Call the recon when the parliamentarian potentially comes back with a yes on the prescription medication. Have a win. It encourages people and motivates people with a win on that recon part one in July. And then do recon part two in B, in B in September. Now, I obviously see what Tina Smith is trying to say. She's trying to say, hey, this is a bait and switch. The provision he doesn't like, he's saying we'll do in September. And guess what, September? I think what Tina Smith is saying, he's not going to do it in September. He's going to try to stonewall you on climate because he doesn't want to ever do it uh it's it's hard to it's hard to read into the equation all we know is that you shouldn't hold up an entire recon because of climate now i know exactly what you're saying when you're looking at the video which one has the checks in there yeah, we really don't know i mean we now have three different build back better acts in 24 hours no do we have four well, actually, we have four. We have the original one, which was three billion. Then we have the one we were told of last week that was one trillion, Sean, not billion, one trillion to one point five trillion, a cohesive one bill, but smaller that still has the ability to give you fifteen to eight thousand dollars of checks. And then now we have a potential two halves. What is in the first half? What is in the second half? It's not particularly clear. They're not telling us. So. Ultimately, this is exactly why three channels are coming to this family. The current channel you're watching right now, LA1. LA2, if you're the type of person who loves to hear every negotiations of Joe Manchin, Chuck Schumer, you love to hear what's in bill in, 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 in one bill this July and what's in one bill this September, that's exactly what LA2 is for. All the geopolitical news you need to know, all the stimulus, 
all the stimulus negotiations, the stimulus checks from the states, the stimulus checks from Joe Biden by executive action, and the stimulus from the Build Back Better Act, or Part 1 and Part 2. <laughs> and then, also on Ally 2 is brand new humor shows and the return of some of your favorite shows as well. Over on Ally 3 is everything you need to know about your benefits. So, your benefits are impacted by inflation, and that's what LA3 is about, the economy, the economy. You need to know what's going off inflation, what's going off recession, and that will be front and center on LA3, plus all the deliciousness of your Brussels sprouts and your sugar-free chocolate cake. Yes, cooking is coming to LA3 with a whole series of new shows. Coming up next is 11 o'clock show, our home show that gives you tracking information about your stimulus. This video will all likely take you there. Then today, afternoons, and it has the brand new afternoon show at 3 o'clock. Yesterday, we had two additional afternoon shows. It seemed you like them, so I'll see if I can give you two additional afternoon shows, but the brand new one, of course, is at 3. Evenings I Like will be brand new tonight at 5 o'clock, and we'll have that housing data when it's released in prime time at 5 o'clock. And don't miss LA Live, which starts at approximately 5.45 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So much money and so great news. $100,000 of four stimulus checks in every U.S. state. Go get them. Become a member. Go right on this video right now. The raise of your benefits up approximately $5,000. That will be detailed more tonight on Evening Daylight. And $15,000 to $80,000 of checks in the Build Back Better Act. A lot of money and a lot in just one video. It's a great day. I know it's going to be hot, so please stay cool. I'll be staying cool with you with all the cool news as well and the cool people and the cool Brussels sprouts and the cool uh, chocolate sugar-free chocolate cake. The toast is toasting. The butter is buttering. It's toasting outside as well. <laughs> it's a big, bold, beautiful day. And just getting started. Thank you for joining me on Mornings. <laughs>